I'm gonna show you guys how I contoured my face to look good on maths. <laughs> and guys, this isn't just how to contour your face for national TV. It's also just how to look really sculpted for like photos and stuff. This product is the Instant Contour Cream Bronzer by Emco Beauty. But I'm gonna apply this all over the cheekbones, the jawline, and what people don't realize is that you have to do the nose. It's so important to do a really good contour, otherwise your face is gonna look extremely flat. And you have to do the 3E technique, which is like three and E. Cream contour blends out the really best when you do a mix of patting and blending. Nose contour is so important because if you have bronzed your entire face and not the center of your face, your face is gonna look so one dimensional and it's not going to look even. And I always bring it up into the underbrow bit. One thing I wish I did more was apply more blush because it fades so much on camera. But this one is the Highlight and Glow Beauty Wand. It's like a dupe for the Charlotte Tilbury guys. Look how pretty that is. Oh, and it melts seamlessly into the cream contour. I'm using the exact same brush. I love to use the same brush so it kind of melts the products together. And whatever's left on the brush. I love to dab that on the center of the nose. Pretty. I wanna go for a more bronze look, so I'm gonna use a bronzier highlighter. And this is again, the Highlight and Glow Beauty Wand. And I'm just gonna apply that just on the tops of the cheekbones and just tap it into the blush. Just give it that glow. Oh, look at that. It almost looks wet, which is definitely the look that I was going for because I knew my face was gonna look flat on TV. Sometimes I like to go back in with the contour and just to add a little bit more, just a bit. And then with a luminous highlighting pen, I like to just go back and really redefine any areas that I want really bright. This makes such a difference to how polished your makeup can look. See, look at that. It already brightened this side of the face. Last but not least, baking. This is gonna stop you from looking oily in photos and just make your skin look like it's glowy in all the areas you want to be intended. Spray. And guys, this is how it looks with flash. You can see how dimensional my face looks. Anyway, hope that helped.